There we go. Suspicious looking eye. I don't know how hard this thing is going to be to beat. We'll find out, I guess. Well, I guess here it comes, huh? Oh, Jesus. Oh. Hey, get out of here, buddy. Apparently, he doesn't care about walls. You keep using these javelins, about the strongest thing I got. Armor seems to be doing me pretty good. Yeah, get him, buddy. <laughs> Thought the NPCs might help. It's hard to say for sure. Can't get away from a bastard. Get a faulty maybe in a more uh, open area. We're doing well in health though. Jesus, we were. <laughs> Try to get back up on top of this house here. We see this health bar slowly going down. Definitely seems beatable. Come on, you damn dirty eye. Let's see what you got. Take health. <laughs> oh. I haven't had to use a healing potion yet. I'm kind of surprised on that. Oh, Jesus. What the hell is it doing now? <gasps> Holy hell. <laughs> ah, get the hell away from me. Jesus. <laughs> Drink out special here real quick. If I can get it out. There we go. Come on, javelins. Just gotta get his new attack pattern down. Got myself stuck in here. I'm screwed every time. Don't be killing any NPCs, buddy. Think we're gonna die here? Can't get away from the damn thing. Yeah, there it was. <laughs> Man, so close. I wonder if it's gonna still be here. It'll be impossible to fight because I won't be able to get my ship back on. Sounds like it's gone. Well, I guess we failed that fight. Yeah, I did so well there for a while, and then when he changed his attack pattern up, that was it. I couldn't freaking get him. Merciful euthanasia by Cthulhu. Alright, guys, we're going to mess around with these minecart tracks, see if we can't grab the lead hammer, because it said something about we might need that to change directions on the end of the track or something. We'll see what happens.
All right, let's see what happens. Doesn't move very fast on its own. Oh, yeah, I figured that was going to happen. All right, let's try this again. I think I can mine while I'm in there, so we'll try that. Next time we get stuck. Now, I'm not pushing any buttons. I'm just letting it go to see what happens. There we go. Clean out another path. <laughs> Slowly descending down into the mine. Hey, get out of the way, buddy. It's going. <laughs> Let's see what happens when we hit this one. Oh, it worked. There we go. Oh, it fell. I think it sucks if I do this. Won't be able to walk up manually anymore. Let's try it again. There we go, worked that time. Yay. I thought you can jump. <laughs> I don't know how to get off of there either and hit the E button. All right, what do we got? 12 left. That ain't enough for nothing. I need like, that was like 200. I need another like, Jesus. This is 200. Two, four, six. I need like eight to get the whole way down there. Yeah, you bastard. I'll take that hard. I need it. Oh, wrong way. There we go. That uh, hook thing is great. I can't believe it took me this long to figure it out. This game actually has a decent tutorial. You just have to pay attention to what he's saying. What's being said to you. Not my strong suit. A lot of times that makes the game more fun because you uh, get to like you know learn from your own mistakes. When you follow a tutorial, sometimes it makes you too good too fast. It's like the same thing as when you do like a... When you look up guides from like wiki and stuff like that. It's great in the moment, but... Kind of ruins your experience in the, overall, in the long run. There are certain some games I've played that you definitely need like a tutorial just to get... Learn how to play. Like freaking Dwarf Fortress. State of the game... Right now, it's pretty good with North Fortress, but when I first started playing it, man, it was fucking bad. Like, you couldn't even tell what anything was or how to do anything. It took me, like, a month of reading guides just to get somewhere in that one. Fun game, though. So, I think today, I see not you can build villages outside of here or anywhere you want. So, I think we're going to go over here to the Snowlands. Build ourselves a new place. Make sure I got everything that I need. I think I do. We're gonna make everything out of stone. God, these bug bastards always follow you for a little bit. <laughs> One of the damn soul eaters trying to build a house here. Victory! 
All right, the real question is, where do we want to build it at? Want to get a couple of these trees before we start? Hmm. I'm thinking right here on this bridge would be a good place to build it. See if we can put a rope up here. There we go. Now, how do we use that? Huh. Well, wow, that's interesting. Yeah, there's a freaking eye. Where'd you come from, you bastard? There's a little one down there. Come chase my platinum sword, you fuckers. Yeah, there you go. Chase that sword. I've seen zombies doing that before. I wonder if they can actually break through your doors. I've never seen any actually break through, but imagine if they're doing that. Means they can. Getting rough over here in the freaking old snow biome. Try to keep a beat or something down there. <laughs> Jamming out down here, zombies. Hell yeah. Hard, 
so I ain't built until the freaking morning. Holy crap. Can't freaking uh, stop the eyes from coming. Snow coat and a snow hood. Not really that good a defense compared to what I got. Longest night ever, man, when you're fighting constantly. That would take that. Nice healing heart right at the end. What the heck is this? Summons the Spiffo Raccoon. Hmm, well, how do I do that? Oh, is that all E? This is how you died. <laughs> Was raccoon kill you or something? Well, it looks like it's... Hey. Come on, buddy. No way, I got a raccoon, buddy. Does he do anything? Can't seem to click on him. How you doing, Mr. Raccoon, buddy? Looks like we're getting out of the ice already. Some kind of weird spot. Oh, this is desert. How the hell did you get in there already, buddy? What have we got in here? Mining potion, recall potion. Oh, yeah. Healing, some more rope. Can of wormies? Oh, I need that. I had one of those for the longest time. I lost it when I died that one time. What the hell's going on now? Can't possibly be dark. Like, it literally just became light out a little bit ago. Oh, it's Evil Lands again. Gee, do I really feel like going in there? Not really. I think we're gonna go back to that tree and see if we can't climb down it. You ready for some splunking, Mr. Raccoon? Doesn't say what he is. Pretty sure he's a raccoon. Spiffo plush. Spiffo the raccoon. I'll try to remember that. Okay, Mr. Spiffo, let's go. It's too cool. All right, so if I wanted to go down here, how the hell would I do it? Ooh, like that, huh? He just pushed down under the platform. I say, don't don't die on me, there, buddy. What's in there? Doesn't look like anything. Say, I can't put a torch there. Torches and some arrows, nothing special. There's a, uh, what the heck is this? Some kind of living wood chest. 
danger sense potion. I don't know what that necessarily means. Living wood wand. Consumes wood, places living wood. Okay. I guess we'll put it on and see what happens. Oh. <laughs> Doesn't seem very useful. Yeah, just let me get my shit resituated here. Glad well, we got those recall potions because apparently I didn't bring any with me. There you go, Mr. Raccoon. Come on in. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. God damn it. Haha, -ha, living loom. Living chair. We will also take the chest too, alright. What do we got here? This looks like some kind of cavern. There we go. We got some frozen pots. Nothing special in there. And this just goes right to there, huh? All right, Mr. Raccoon, down the uh, Mr. Spiffo. We're heading down the chute again. Can't barely see him in the dark here. There's some lead. And we'll take it. Some blink root seeds. I don't really know what they do. Got a bunch of them at home. I just never did anything with them. Also, I gotta go find some of that purple ore and see if we can't mine it with this tungsten pickaxe. All right. Do that there. Much more torches? I'll take it. I actually need them. All right, what do we got here? Nothing much over there. Doesn't look like much of anything in here. Guess he got a place to torch, huh? <laughs> He's fine with his tail. It's a impressive trick there, buddy. Teach me that. Just some wooden arrows, huh? back here. Hold on, nothing. A lot of these caves, man, aren't very rewarding unless you go, like, really, really deep. Like, I didn't start finding stuff till I got right to this level. Like, on a regular basis, anyway. Up here is, like, you might find, like, spots with five or six orders. That's about it. I just see some lead. Might as well go get it. What else are we going to do? Just stone, huh? What the hell is that? It's like a gnome or something. Die, you stupid gnome. Jesus. I didn't expect him to be, uh, dangerous. Oh, that's cool, man. Oh, it is night out. Huh. 